Hello everybody, I am back with another box for you. Can you say hi, bud? You gonna be shy? Okay, so we have our last month of um, the Kids Bookcase Club. So I believe it averages out to be about $10 a month, $5 shipping. I did the three month subscription and then I ended up canceling it, but I love it. So this is the third month. Um, I do plan to restart it especially with homeschooling and whatnot. Um, it's great for these kids to be reading these books. I really like them. Um, I just don't know when I'm going to restart it just because I've got a lot of things going on. But we're going to open it up. You want to say hi? We're going to open up this box and see what we've got. So the last month's box, the Night King or something like that, my kids loved it. So for three out of five of the kids have read it. Obviously, he can't read. Uh, but I'm really impressed with that book. I even started reading it. It's got some bigger words in it, but it's still a great book. Are you okay? Huh? So, okay. Do you want your blankie? Thank you. Okay, we're going to pull these out and check them out. So each month so far has had a chapter book and then smaller books for like the littler kids. This is the box for seven to eight year old boys. Uh, I did that specifically so my 7 year old, 9 year old, and 10 year old can all read them since my 10 year old reads at a kindergarten first grade level whereas my 7 year old reads like her brother at a higher level. So anyways, here we go. We're going to check these out. Do you want to see Vincent? Ooh. <gasps> Vincent! <gasps> what is it? <gasps> Dinosaurs? We got a dinosaur book and yeah, you see your dinosaur over there? There's a di what does a dinosaur say? You're not gonna say it? Okay, so the first book we have is Dino Riders How to Track a Pterodactyl um, by Will Dare. So that's a chapter book. This is definitely it's got some bigger words in it, like bigger size words, which is perfect for younger readers. Um I saw a little bit of illustrations, not a ton, which is nice. What is that? Dinosaur! He just got a bath. He's probably sleeping now. Um, so yeah, there we go. This is a chapter book, which is cool. Uh, it looks like he's got five other books, dino, all called Dino Writers, but all with different dinosaurs. So there's that one. $5.99 US. So six dollars there. Okay, the next one is Draw It Yourself Adventures Spy Mission. Draw a new story every time. Uh, by Andrew Judge and Chris Judge. You want to show the camera? This one is ten ninety nine US. Hold on, we're gonna open it up and look. What the heck? He's on the toilet. Hmm. Oh, I guess they leave a little bit. Yeah, they get, they wait, 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 look. So there are some pages that are empty for you to do things, but then there was other pages that are more full. I don't know, maybe you draw in the book. There's some cap, there's some bold words in there as well. I'm gonna have to check this one out. Big trouble. Oh, okay, so, it, so like this one on this page here. Uh, it says, big trouble. Everyone looks very annoyed. Yeah. How are we going to talk our way out of this one? Maybe you gotta go page by page and tell your own story, like the, the title says. I was just confused on how that would work when it's all colored in. I was thinking it was going to have words and such, and you do the illustrations for it. That's what I was thinking. So this is a little different than I thought, but that's cool. What do you think? Oh, you want to show them the book? He loves books. And the last one is Mad Scientist. Yeah, it's a book. Academy, The Ocean Disaster by Matthew McElligot. Elligo? Elligo? Can we show them? Good job. You got to turn it around so they can see. Um, and this one doesn't say the price. Hold on. We're we looking. We're looking. Let's open it. Do you want to open it? Okay. Wow. Check that cover out. 
Is that pretty cool? Ocean Disaster. This one kind of reminds me of like a it's comic. It's a comic type book. Which is cool. If you watch my video posted right before or after this, you'll know that I'm getting into buying and selling comics. So I'm gonna try my hand at it anyways. So that's pretty cool. Jellyfish, angelfish, a crab, seaweed, turtles, a mermaid. There's a mermaid. A mermaid. Yeah. Okay, so those are the three books. I will say I'm kind of blah to this this week, this month's box. Um, but I do think that the kids will like it. And so what I did with the last book is I made each kid read one chapter a day of the book, of the chapter book. You want to look? There's dinosaurs in there. Do you want to go find your dinosaur? Over there? Can you go get your dinosaur out of your bed? Um, go find the dinosaur. It's, uh, each kid, so basically what I did is my son, when he got to chapter three, then I started the next child on chapter one, and then when they got to, um, on two, then the third child started it. So, started chapter one. So they were each on a different chapter, uh, and then they could tell each other about the story when they were all done with it, and we could all learn about it together. Yeah, you like that book? And this one will be really fun for my 12-year-old who, who likes to draw and stuff. She can do her own story. Um, and the Mad Scientist Academy. I gotta look more into that when he's, not, when he's not sitting on my lap. But this one looks really cool. And I really like the illustrations on this one. Hey, don't eat the book. Uh, so yeah, that is, that's month three. I am curious to know if everyone who picks the boys seven to eight book get these exact same books. Or if they're a little bit different. Is that Bentley? Yeah, that was Bentley as a baby. Uh, see if they get like the same one. Okay, okay. Or a little bit different. Um, and I do want to check out some of these other books, maybe for the girls. I didn't want to get the girls' books because I was worried they were more princessy and pink, um, which isn't a problem, but I wanted more, a little bit different than the stereotypical girls' box. Um, especially because these are not super like boyish, I would say. I was thinking more it was going to be like, Cars and monster Ooh. trucks and such. Dad. Yeah, what is it? Uh, but these are actually really good for they're, they're gender neutral. So, anyways, guys, those are the three books we got this month. Um, I will say I think that if I would have gotten this box first, I would have probably canceled it. Um, even though I did cancel it after box one, but I I am gonna get it again. But I think I'm gonna get it um a different. I'm thinking go up one age as well as try out the girl box. I might do the girl and a boy box just to see, compare them to, to be different. But, um, yeah, there you go. So if you guys are checking out this box, feel free to let me know. There isn't a referral link or anything, but I will have the link oh. down below. Uh, I did get it during their Black Friday deal, so I did get a little bit of a sale on it. But still, I, I definitely see the value on this box i love the box itself the company is awesome and i definitely recommend checking them out so check them out if you are interested like i said i think they go up to age 12 or 14. they do a preteen uh, box what oh did i pull your hair uh they do a preteen box but i don't think they do teen boxes i have to look okay can you say goodbye you want to say bye-bye no, you just want the picture. So, anyways, guys, I will see you in the next video. Um, feel free to check those out because it's probably going to be comic books. So, yeah. See you later, guys. I see, I see. It's Bentley and Lucia. Say bye. Bye.